There once was a town. Not a big town. Not a little town. But smallish. Oh yes, a smallish town that went by the name of Nothing. During 2012, I was looking for a play related to the Olympic Games. That's when I came across a collection of scripts called The Nutting Plays by Steve Morley, and that's where I found the Nutting Unique Olympic Games. When I read the play, I thought it was different, especially because it was written almost entirely for ensemble. I thought it was funny and had a lot of scope for interpretation, so I gave it to a smallish group of my year tens. I'm cleaning the windows. They loved it. They were delighted that everyone had an equal part to play and that they could add their own ideas about delivery, costume, physicality and, to a large extent, who would speak which lines. Since then, I have performed some other plays from the collection with different ear groups and each time the response from the casts was the same. This year, I did The Witch of Nutting with a cast of 13 Year 8 and 9 performers. I asked them to record some of their reactions. Th these kinds of machines are the best kinds of machines that have ever made. They are nigh perfect. Yeah! <laughs> One thing that I really enjoyed about doing The Witch of Nutting was the fact that it was an ensemble piece, so there weren't, so there weren't any main characters or supporting characters, and I find that was really enjoyable to do. No, he is dead. Was it you? No. It was you. <laughs> One thing I enjoyed about The Witch and Nutting was the freedom we had with the scripts. I mean, we could manipulate ev anything. We could change the stage directions, we could choose the effects, we can really control what we could do. And I think that was, that was a key thing with The Witch and Nutting. I really enjoy being part of The Witch of Nutting cast. We got to do what we like with the costumes and everything was really free and we got to do what we like. If you are looking for something different to perform, written for an ensemble, a comedy for between a dozen and up to say 30 performers, then the nutting plays are certainly worth a look. <laughs>